Run, come over here and listen to this news because this news is a once in a lifetime news. This news is yes, not easy. This news is yeah, good. Caribbean News Global bringing you news briefly from around the world. On Thursday, the 29th of February, the police did a diligent move by going to a cemetery where people was burying their deceased and had an operation. Why, I don't know, the news did not say, but they were able to recover a firearm with live ammunition and made an arrest. This might seem like disrespect to the persons in grief, but at the same time, we should be happy because they saved somebody's life. We don't know what would have happened at that cemetery, where the shooting would have begun or not. But we know the police went there, did their diligent duty, raid that cemetery, and arrest someone and recover ammunition and firearm. It is sad to say you cannot go to a funeral and feel comfortable while in time of grief and paying respect to grieving friends and families like years gone back. Two places are uh, three places you could have really go and feel comfortable well was school, church, and funeral, knowing that no one will come to harm you. But now everyone Everyone have to be looking over their shoulder when they are going to school, are uh, in school, when they are going to church, are uh, in church, when they are going to a funeral mass, are uh, in the funeral itself, in the cemetery, because somebody will always try to come to disrupt. It is very sad, and I am proud of what the police officers did in St. Lucia. This should be done not just in St. Lucia in the Caribbean, but all over. It's time to stop crime and violence. We need to feel safe wherever we may go. Just look at this video. Look how many people was in the cemetery. If shooting had started, somebody would have got wounded, possibly even died. So I give, I tip my hat to the police officers of the St. Lucia Police Force, Defense Force, and Military Force and Undercover Agents. Good job. Well done.